But just look at that part. Like, just get all the all the shit. That's why Joe went in on her exactly thread. Like Petty didn't show y'all the full thread. Forehead, she be on and off, y'all. She she um she be on here and shit. Yeah, like let's look at it all. Let's look at all the things. Let's look at everything. And I, you know, that was just brought to my attention because that that don't make sense. You got to make it make sense. So it might be that Keith might be thinking something, you know what I'm saying, thinking something, but it's not. He, he thinking that Petty said that, but Petty didn't say that. All Petty did was agree. But So Petty was like, we'll take turns. So I guess it's not different, but it kind of, I'm thinking it kind of would change. Yeah, but when did they? A little bit. My bad. No, I ain't gonna say nothing. I'm gonna go on mute. Okay. No way, you know. Yeah, it's agreeing at the same thing. It's the same thing. Thank you, boo. But I just thought, um, you know what I'm saying? That should have been pointed out. That's yeah. all. More than what it is. So, Petty diss me on live, but don't want to talk to me on live. I think you may have left, Ashley. He said, I don't know if you yeah. were still in there. He said, um, when I, Ashley, when I finished talking to my best friend, I guess he's on the phone with his best friend, he said, I'm going to talk to you. Oh, look how it looks. Mm. Mm. Look how I can't Hold on, talk to my beautician. Yeah, he's still uh, indulged in the conversation. I know. You about to see. Yeah, he said, um, yeah, I mean, look. Mm. Y'all need, mm. I mean, maybe, maybe it, Petty, Petty probably had an attraction to Keith when he first met him uh, back then. That's what, what I'm saying. He was dropped. And, uh, and no, I don't care what none of y'all say. Like I said, I'm just looking at it both ends, but I'm not going to jump on the hate pity train or the hate chief train. I'm not yeah, ain't nobody Exactly. Exactly. Ain't no uh, y'all motherfuckers all want to jump on. Hey, let's be real. And people to come in. Petty ain't did nothing to y'all. But y'all so quick to just jump. Oh, oh, yeah. We, oh, Petty's fake. Oh, we hate Petty. Like, man, like, come on, bro. Yeah. Petty said up here with Ashley every day, all day long, every day. Right. And y'all was loving him. His feelings just hurt. That's all. His feelings just hurt. And I, I, I know how he feel when everybody seems like they're against you. I know how that feels. And that's the feeling. That's not a good feeling. The thing is, it, 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 you you still been given a chance to calm down. I think I think all the extra people need to move around. Joe, KLB, all them, Petty, mm-hmm. Keith. Need to be on that panel, all that extra stuff. We don't care about what was said because at the end of the day, all y'all done talked about Keith. Just being real. So with that, with that being said, with that being said, they need to just let Petty and Keith mm-hmm. sit there and let them talk. All that extra stuff in the middle, making noise and stuff. When it comes to me and the mediation, I can't immediate when extra people is sitting in the middle. Yeah, he called Brandon bro, and that was some felonious stuff. Mm-hmm. Who can immediate when you got other people in the middle are planning to attack you? Ain't nobody innocent at the end of the day. I'm going to tell you something. I know a lot. A lot of stuff. And I keep my mouth closed knowing what I'm knowing. And knowing that it's a lot of fake people. And I know who don't like me. Who don't like who. Who said what about what. And the stuff they said is way more versa than Petty saying he got a crush on Keith. But you know what I'm saying? I don't say stuff. I keep quiet. There's a lot of fake stuff going on around these Vigo streets with people that claim they love and miss with Keith. I, I, I mean, I, I meet you. I meet you. But because everybody just trying to fix it where they don't want Keith to be on to what they saying and dodge the bullet of what they be saying. 
they want to act like they just deep into this petty stuff. <laughs> don't mess with me. Don't say nothing to me. Don't throw no shots at me. Because I promise you, I will open up from the book of Genesis all the way to the book of Revelation. And I air all y'all like. So y'all better stay away from me. And don't question me about being on no show or not being on no show. Leave me alone. Y'all can record this. Give this to Ivy tomorrow. And I said what I said and I'm stand on it. Nobody kicking nobody. I mean, yeah. some some of the congregation people are actually admins. So yeah, the congregation people is my people. Kick. So if they can yeah. kick, it, 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 uh -uh. yeah, Rebecca. But some of the church members are her admins. Hold on, so, hold on. What's going on with the church members? What, what, what's going on? No, somebody said somebody said why is people kicking if you say something about Keith? I'm not kicking for that. Who's I kicking? know you got some of the church members. It's your admin, so I don't know. This time I'm going to do this. Who kicking? Ain't Janet no lie. Yeah, I don't see nobody doing nothing. No, so that means. That's all. That means. Yeah, they shouldn't. They shouldn't, though. It shouldn't there shouldn't be, be no mute yeah. or nothing. With nobody petty or kicking. Yeah, it should be. Nobody it. should be kicking or muting for opinions. Oh, I see. Somebody said um, Keith was fake. They got muted. Oh, yeah. I ain't seen nobody kicking me. I, I accidentally met somebody and I unmuted them. I said, my bad, I didn't mean to unmute um, you. But that, nobody's in kicking me. He's not fake because if he's prevent, presented this stuff from... Um, okay, so listen. Oh, know, please be talking my live. Give me one minute, please. So if he's presented by pity old best friend, these receipts, he don't know for he is. What do you expect? Then Ms. B pops up again with some more stuff. Then Forehead, she been licking windows waiting on her big day to tribute. Cause Forehead hate him. Okay. Um, she mm -hmm. missed that friendship. She missed that friendship. Then she pop up with receipts. What do you want Keith to believe? Yeah. Oh, I know Fohead don't like Keith neither. Just like she the one that called Joe gay. And Joe trying to make it about Petty. Petty called me gay, but you so busy want to prove a point that you hate Petty with everybody else. Fohead the one called you gay in them text messages. Yeah, Fohead the one. Yeah. Petty wrong because you won't give Keith just his just the conversation, because as you can see this morning, I ain't gonna lie, I thought Keith was gonna come up and read them. Keith still came up, got quiet, and once he had Petty explained, Petty said, fuck all y'all, and he left. This is like, come on, he's still trying to let you, okay, so explain these messages from forehead, explain this. So, I think in Keith's mind, because they cool, Keith still want to believe that Petty it's innocent because, listen, I've been going at it with Keith for years. You know what I'm saying? And Keith really don't give this type of chance and this type of calmness to people. I think because him and Petty really had a friendship and really had it and he really thought never seen this coming, he really wants to believe that this all going to come out to be a lie. That's why he ain't lighting Petty up the way he is. And Petty not seeing that. You looking at, oh, I'm a fool with Keith. I'm going to get clout. Let me go live and work this on my thing. At this point, it ain't about clout. If it was your real friend, it ain't about clout. And I'm just being real. I I feel like, um, I feel like Petty just, I don't know, I feel like he just don't want to deal with it no more. I mean, he feel like it's just him by himself fighting versus, like, everybody. You feel what I'm saying? Look, I'm still cool with him. I would say she's still cool with him. I'm still cool with Petty. But Petty not going to disrespect me and play in my face with no ill and no branding. If he want to continue to keep them around, he might as well close the door on me. Yeah, that was messed but up. One thing he's going to do, one thing he's going to do, he's going to tell the truth that he told me. And he told me him and Keith never had nothing going on. And to make yourself not look like you weak and you a set up faggot like the rest of these faggots, you're going to tell the truth if you my friend. You're going to tell the truth if you my friend. Because I put this on my mama, Nicole. Me and Petty have talked. And when, and when people used to be trolling him, oh, you even even Lieutenant then accused Petty of sleeping with Pastor. I'm just being real. Lieutenant always calling Pastor gay. 
But now past up that she quiet. That's why I say it's a whole bunch of fake shit. So my thing is, when Lieutenant and everybody was coming, she was sleeping with him and this and that. You call my phone sister. I never slept with him. That's big bro. I love my big bro. That's my big bro. It's nothing. It's never been nothing. I never, it's never nothing. It's nothing. Okay. The same way you damn near broke down to me about it, be, be, be yourself. Don't give the people what they want for be, for beans. Be a man and, and say that if you, if you want to continue to be with me, t speak your truth. Be like, no, I ain't going to lie. He never tried to mess with me. It ain't never been nothing. Because I feel like this, if you're gonna let a, if you gonna hold a lie on him as a grudge, you'll do it to me. I don't care what Keith wrote in no group chat. Don't lie on yourself and sell your soul to make somebody look bad. Because you mm -hmm. still showing every day I talk about faggots being put behind trash cans to playing with men livelihoods. I can't call you my friend if you're going to pretend going to start being the new Lowe's and the new Savannah's and the new Charity Booms. I'm not for gay men setting up straight men. I'm not for that. I always talk about that. I get into it with all y'all about that, about why I feel like they be getting popped and put in trash cans because they play with real men. I so you're not going to be my friend and do the same thing. I need Petty to tell his truth. You told me, you said, and, 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 and listen, I ain't talking about recently. He have been saying to me for months, me and Pastor only brothers, it's nothing like that. That's my dog. When I'm with Keith, it's like I'm one of the homies. So I need for you to be honest. When you be honest with yourself, you'll feel better. You're not feeling good about yourself right now because you know you're telling a lie. If Petty would be real with himself, I can help him with the risk. Because I know the risk fake jumping on him for no reason. I know the risk can't afford to talk about him with the shit they didn't see or the shit I done heard they didn't done and put out here. If he could just tell his truth and be real to a person that came to your house, you went shopping with him and the boys, y'all was partners, you always took up for not too much on Pete. If you can prove to me you can be real with that person, then you can prove to me that you're real with me. Because right now, Petty, me and you supposed to be close. And now, I'm like, damn, can I come to your house? Maybe can I come see. around? Can I do this? Shit, are you going to get mad? And because motherfuckers got you under pressure, you going to lie and say something about me? You ain't looking at the whole thing. Yeah, I feel that. But what I'm saying is, if he be real and just, come on, put your pride to the side and be real, the rest of them... <laughs> I look through them like water because I know what all they just said. I know about their secret conversations. And he shouldn't take offense to what y'all saying to him because because y'all fuck with him like that. So he should be able to take it and you know do something. <clears throat> he don't need to get offensive. Let me say this also, to everybody: I'm not scared of Keith. Keith know when me and him go with it, we go with it. But we don't have a reason when we sit down and we think. Brandon was become a denomination, denominator, and me and Keith dragging each other, kids dragging this, dragging it. Cause I know a lot of people are like, oh, Keith, uh, talked about your kids, but yeah, but me, yeah, we popped off. I said he was a rapist and all type of stuff. You know what I'm saying? We both did that, okay? Everybody need to respect it. I know everybody say what they said, but let me tell you something. It really ain't no roasting my kids. Cause when I get through, bitch, I'ma devour yours, okay? So y'all can't keep using it at me. But at the end of the day, me and Keith finally got together and decided we don't have to well, now they back there with it talking about now they over there talking about you ain't you not coming to the show and all that shit. I don't know. Let me talk. Let me talk. You ain't gotta go to that show if you don't want to. Oh my bad, Gabe. First of all, he said I ain't going to no show. Please start trying to deflect my conversation. Like I said, me, I'm not talking to nobody. If they believe it, they believe it. I'm not in the ass kissing business. You hear me? Me and Keith have went at it for years. And it took us to find out that we really don't have a beef. Okay? 
So with that being said, now that we don't have people in the middle keeping up mess, me and Keith do not have bump in. We might have a few comments and a few family members that try to paint a narrative. But Keith know that I don't call his personal phone. I don't ask him personal questions. I don't get in relationships. I don't get in his baby mama sis. I don't have nothing to say about what he got going on in the real world versus other people want to be in this man's business. But with that being said, it's a respect because I stay in my lane when he do his thing. Only thing I'm saying is I left because I needed to go and talk to Petty to tell Petty you need to tell the truth because me and you friends you and Keith was best friends according to you you and Keith was best friends and I know for a fact you didn't sleep with Keith because when people threw slugs at you you said sister that's my big bro I put this on everything. Me and bro never moved like this. Because everybody in your ear, everybody pumping you up, don't sell your soul to a lot. That's all I'm saying. And that's fair. You say you cashy. You say you got your stuff going. You say you got your reputation. But right now you're ruining your reputation because you want people to think it's something going on. You ain't saying there's nothing going on, but then again, you not saying nothing didn't happen. I want you as my friend to be real and say the truth. You know ain't nothing happened. Yeah, Keith came to your house. Yeah, y'all went shopping with the boys. Yeah, y'all was close. Yeah, y'all talked because y'all was friends. Just say you mad because of what he believed or whatever. And that's why you said what you said. Am I wrong for asking him that? Bye. Honey, have a good day. I just want to know, Dre, am I wrong for saying it? Am I wrong for saying it? If Paddy be real and say that, then I can come over there and the rest of it, I can knock that out the way. I know he didn't have them. That's what's bothering me. I know he did. Because Petty called my phone too many times about people making comments about him and Keith. And it bothered him because Keith was his brother. Yeah. Uh, that's it. That's it. That's all, really. It could be squash in a matter of seconds. I feel like if if Teddy would just be a man about it, man up and say what you said, like eat it, go ahead, yeah. just say it. Yeah, they gonna say him fake stuff over there. I'm gonna say him real. And like I said, he won't get mad at you, Ashley, if he for real, for real respects you and shit like that for telling him what's real. He's not gonna get mad and defensive. Oh, I know, I know for a fact he'll never be cool with um Keith again because Keith manhood. You know, is more important, and that's good. It's supposed to be his manhood is a very important factor to him, and I know it'll never be cool again. But come on, man! Even though whatever the message was, you still need to free yourself. Because if you if, if you don't lie like that, like, Petty mm -hmm. just need to be quiet. Just be quiet. Just keep your loyalty as it See, is. Petty, nobody wouldn't have knew. I'm going to tell you why it's hard for me. 
you said with Ev, Ev say my daughter got raped and it wasn't true. Ev said a lot of stuff. The stuff you doing now with no proof. Brandon lies. All them, all your brothers and sisters last night that were throwing you beans you was comfortable with, you didn't think about me. A person you know that can't stand her. Anybody know me know I hate ill with a passion. You made them feel welcome. You shitted on the fact that you fuck with China. You shit on the fact you mess with me. You sh Yeah, everybody hate her. You shit on the fact that you mess with a lot of us. That's true. You got to uh, eat that next, cause he over there. Brandon, Brandon gifted him. I didn't even know Brandon gifted him. Y'all don't think that slapped me in my face when he was saying, "Brandon, bro, thank you, big bro." Oh, he said, "Thank you, bro." He said, "Thank you, big bro." Yeah, he was calling. Yeah, him. thank you, big bro. He thank you, big bro. Him. Hey, <laughs> girl, I ain't never had no problem with you. We ain't got no beef. Man, let me tell you something. When he said, L, we ain't never had no beef. We good. Oh, I ain't My, that Man, I think I went into a, 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 a I think I could have damn near had a stroke. My head started hurting, dread. I started getting mm. sick to the stomach. Yeah, all of that. Yeah, I know he was inviting them. He said, well, nobody getting kicked. Mm -hmm. But I didn't know Brandon was over there gifting him and he called him yeah, bro and all that shit. Thank you. <sighs> yeah, Brandon was gifting him. Alright. Child gang gang wasn't even hey, that shit. Was, 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 gang gang was just who we keep got there. Somebody just said, and, and this is exactly what I'm talking about. Somebody said came up and uh, over there and said so. It seemed like to me that everybody that was cool with, I ain't talking about um, you, Ash, obviously, you're not, you still cool with him. But uh, she said, it seemed like to me everybody that was cool with Petty then found a reason to separate themselves from him. Is it because of Keith or what's going on? Because was any of y'all his friends? That's what somebody just said over there. And that's true. And that's the shit that I was saying last that's night. That's the eye like, That's the eye Yeah, 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 yeah. And, Come and, on, and, and that's the shit. Uh, 